today we're actually going to do a quick grafting exercise to hopefully show you what you can do for grafting fruit trees. Now to start, we're actually going to get our base tree, or our rootstock, ready. We're gonna remove this branch, so that way we only have one branch that we're actually working with. So here I have my scion wood, and what I wanna do is find a piece of scion wood that matches the diameter of the rootstock that I'm going to be grafting it to. I will cut my rootstock, or my base wood. I will then make my V-cut and my notch into the wood. So now I'm going to do my notch cut. Basically, I want it the same depth as what I have made on my V-cut. Once we have fitted our V-cut into the notch on the tree, we will then want to seal it up with a grafting tape or electrical tape. This will help prevent disease and water loss of the new grafting section. Now that these two are attached, I'm actually going to cut off the top of my scion wood to leave three or four buds. That way there is not too much energy that is going into a really long stem. Grafting can be completed during any portion of the year. The best success, however, is usually in early spring or early summer. Grafting is sometimes a challenge, so patience is definitely a good thing to have. From the University of Wyoming Extension, I'm Brian Sebade, and you're watching From the Ground Up.